Hi there guys, my name is Stuart from Marshall Music and I have Diervold with me, my trusty friend, companion, companion, professional companion and, and non-professional sometimes. But let's be serious and talk about Taylor GS Minis. We've got the Taylor GS Mini Bass, we've got the Taylor GS Mini Walnut, Walnut. We've got the Taylor GS Mini Mahogany um, Sapele, which is just the Taylor GS Mini. Sapele is a cheap mahogany. We've got a Taylor GS Koa, which is all Koa. And the only one missing is the Taylor GS Mini Mahogany, which is an all mahogany one. So yeah, we're just gonna talk um, about them very briefly. Most of them come with or without pickups, but... Um, this has a pickup. This has a pickup. You can install your own pickup into them. You know, a lot of guys will stick in a, a nice Fishman Prefix Plus or something, or even a sound hole pickup. Um, you can do whatever you like, which is really cool. So yeah, we're just gonna jam some stuff. And as I understand, as you explained, this is the cheapest of the lot. No, that the, one is. Oh, the Sapele. The Sapele one, yeah. And the Walnut. <coughs> the Walnut's kind of in the middle of the range. Because I want to say, if this is the cheapest, this is gorgeous. For yeah. They're super cool. Do you know what I did with my GS Mini? Also, if you like it, and it brings out the word, is you can polish these guitars. I, I, I polished completely. Because this has got a very polished. satiny finish. <coughs> yeah. So what you can do is polish them, and they go brilliant. You can see all the flame in this maple, and it's fantastic. And I think, as you'll hear, the GS Mini, I know I owned a GS Mini a couple of years ago, and uh, people always think the smaller body will make up for a thinner sound, but actually not. As you might see, what they did is they actually brought out the back a little bit more to yeah. compensate for the yeah. size. And I mean, super it's super loud as well, super yeah. loud. And then uh, from what you will hear is we're not plugging this in so that you can hear the sound like we hear it in here. So we've got an XY microphone in the front. And uh, yeah, we're not plugged in at all. Yeah. There'll be no EQ. We'll add a little bit of compression and stuff afterwards. So it's just sounds yeah. a bit better, a bit of reverb but what you'll hear is actually the sound of the guitar. Yeah. Let's play a... a Tell us about what you have. Oh yeah, so, so this is a full range bass. Um, and yeah, I mean, also with a pickup, Sapele back and sides, it's awesome. It's really loud, full range, as I said. Super loud, like for campfire jamming, jamming with your buddies in the lounge. It's, it's really awesome. Um, so yeah, let's jam. Yeah, man, this is full sounding acoustic. Okay, yeah, let's switch. Very lucky. Switch the let's switch. Hello, one. <laughs> Switcheroo. So yeah, exactly same guitar. Doesn't have pickup. Yeah. So this is obviously the cheaper one. And I mean, I'm playing without a pick now, but so. Nice, fat. Yeah, it's lacquer. I mean, this is actually so loud, I'm struggling to hear <laughs> the bass where I'm sitting, yeah. so how loud this little guitar is. Yeah. Cool, and then my favorite, just from purely looks-wise. Beautiful. The Koa. 
This thing is gorgeous. Yeah. I mean, they are the best looking, there's no doubt, but, but, but don't always think that because it's the most expensive and the fanciest looking, often it's not the best sounding because it is very bright. Um, but, uh, yeah. Much brighter, well. That was completely rubbish. At least the guitar sounded great. I think the <laughs> note, the note choice was terrible. But you yeah, should have rehearsed. We We've should have been rehearsing the whole day. The whole day, I've been practicing, <laughs> and uh, yeah, cool. I think these guitars are great. I think um, if you're starting out, you know, as an entry level tailor, not that these guitars are entry level, but I mean, they're for for smaller hands and stuff. Yeah. So, I mean, let's be serious. The proper tailors are expensive machines yeah. they're worth every cent but i think starting out these guitars are fantastic absolutely i think if you are in a worship team which always you need you know acoustic guitar these sound incredible they feel incredible so easy to play yeah especially for if you're a female guitarist not yeah. doing anything but for female smaller hands you know this is just so easy easy super easy and yeah. they sound amazing yeah Cool. Well, I mean, well, we'll put links in the description below to go check out more info about them or buy it. We'll buy one online. Um, yeah, Taylor GS Minis, fantastic stuff. That's all for now, guys. Ciao.